Hi guys, Bridget Lindenborg here. Saying first of all, thank God for an amazing, an amazing life and an amazing journey that He has given me within the last 49 years. I'm about to be 50 in two weeks and I'm very grateful. Very grateful because I think about everything that He has uh, allowed me to go through. The journey, the tears, the loss, the wins, the gains, the disappointments, the laughter, the friends, the enemies, the haters, the lovers, everyone. I thank God for the journey. But as I think of everything that has happened to me, I think about two very important things. What is being rich and what is being wealthy? And to me, it, it, it means something different. You know, um, everybody is running to be rich. Everybody's running to have the luxury and to have the most and, and to show others that they did it and that they made it. But in reality, we are rich. We are rich if we have healthy kids. We are rich if we can wake up every morning and know who we are. Me, I know who I am and whose I am. So I'm rich. I'm rich because I wake up every morning to a man that God has put in my life that I know that loves me. Whether I have hair or no hair, whether I have makeup or no makeup, he, he loves me and he shows me not with what he gives me or buys me, but because of his actions. I'm rich. I'm rich because I know what I want. I'm rich because I'm able to share those things with you guys. Now, do I want to be wealthy? Yes. I'm striving for that. And, and I, I know I'm going to get there, but I don't want to get there if I'm not rich. I want to be able to be rich along the way so when I do acquire that wealth that God has for me, I can enjoy it. There's many of you out there that have a lot or have acquired a lot and are miserable, are lonely, are sad. Although you are acquiring wealth, you have lost your richness, the, rich, the richness that you truly want to be able to share that with the person that you started with to be able to share that with people that you know that truly love you and that care for you, not because of what you have, but because of who you are. And that is important. It's important for people to know the difference between being rich and, and, and being wealthy. We are rich if we can enjoy the things that everyday life gives us. Those, those special little moments, those special little things that we take for granted. That's being rich. I'm rich because I have two amazing kids that they haven't been perfect. They have given me trials, but they're healthy. I know they love me. They're not in jail. They're not wanted. They're not in drugs. They're not prostitute. They're, not, they're, 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 they're healthy. They're striving to do the best they can with their life. And they acknowledge me as their mom. I'm rich. I'm rich because God has given me the opportunity not just to see one or two, but four grandchildren, two daughters from my son, two boys from my daughter. I'm rich. I'm rich to know that I have a, 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 a son-in-law that respects me and that wants to make my, my daughter happy because he knows that that's important to me. I'm rich. I'm rich when you guys text me because I didn't feel good last week because you were concerned about my health and because you guys were praying for me. I'm rich. But we take away the importance of the reality with what we want and we don't get to enjoy what we have. And sometimes what we have is all we have. Remember that today is the gift. Tomorrow is not promise. Start enjoying your today. Start loving what you have. And, and don't ever want to have 
but it's going to take away from you, you, with the people that really love you. I know that so many people right now are thinking in their mind, you know, I wish I go back to the beginning when I didn't have all of this. Because now I have all of this and I'm alone. Yeah, you, you lost your richness. Go back to being rich. Go back to being happy. Go back to enjoying those, those special moments. You know, I love when Richard takes me out to dinner and he, and he wants to, to, to do things for me. But you know what I love the most? When he cooks and we stand in front of the TV and we eat and, and we just spend quality time together and just do nothing. I'm rich because I'm enjoying the richness of life. And I know a lot of you are very young and, and I admire that because I wish I was in my 20s doing what I'm doing today. I wish, but it didn't happen. So I'm not gonna, you know, be like, oh my God, I'm not gonna do anything because I'm always gonna be 50 and I don't have what I want. No, I don't have what I want, but I have a lot more and I have the strive and I have the strength to know that if I continue to push, I'll get there. And if I never get there, it's okay because I'm enjoying the rich journey. And, and that's important. Enjoy your today. Enjoy what you have. Treasure it. And if you don't like it, change it. People will always talk. People will always criticize you, no matter what. No matter what you have, no matter what you show them, no matter what, the people are always gonna talk. But be rich while they're talking, enjoy. So what they hate you? So what they unblock you? So what? Enjoy the journey. Be rich with what you have. So when your wealth gets here, it doesn't matter. You have enjoyed. God bless you. I see you on the other side. Remember, the best is yet to come.